Hey, it's Mike again. We're on a road trip. We had to go back to Fultonville, deliver some puppies. People are happy to see their, their new... Uh, Here we are again on the banks of the Erie Canal. Why? Because we have a puppy delivery. Yep, we're back at the Dunkin' Donuts. Look at all these beautiful puppies that people are taking home today. Enjoy. Huh? Who's ready to go for a road trip? Hmm? Puppies are going to your new home. That's one, whoop. That's one crate ready to go. All right. Now I'll go get another crate. Huh? Are you guys ready to go to your new homes? Hmm? Hope you guys got out. I gotta lock that better, huh? You guys got out, huh? There you go. There you go. There we are. There we are. We got it. Okay, let me go grab another crate. Huh? Put two in here. Dark blue. Grab another crate. For light green. And red. And red. So the two purples and pink. Here we are. Here we are. Are the two purples and the pink are staying here. Let's make sure we get these locked in. There we are. Okay. And I'll strap you in. And then we'll be ready to go. Bye guys. I'm going on a road trip. I'm taking your pals with me. All right? So you guys be good. You got water, and you got food, and you got toys, but I'm taking your pals with me. All right? They're going to their new homes today. They're going to their new homes today. Hands up on the seat have to be belted down. We'll get that done here. Yeah. Okay, you guys are in. Everybody's in nice and safe. Yeah, I'm gonna get dressed and we're gonna go on a road trip. All right, guys, are you ready to go on a road trip? Are you ready to go on your road trip? Ready to find your new homes? Go to your new families? Are ya? You? you ready? All right, let's get underway. You guys have quite the audience coming. Here we are again on the banks of the Erie Canal in Fultonville, New York. 
had some wonderful folks that just okay. been reunited with their yeah. puppies. Did anybody want to sample a food to take with them? Yes, oh, thank, thank you. I'll take a sample too. Oh, yeah. Thank you. I already go grab some, another. Okay. I'll go you. grab another one. Is it for me or to eat? Yeah, or, yeah, or, yeah oh. absolutely. Yeah, you want a snack on that. We'd like to. Come on, Rosie. So cute. We'd like to thank everyone who took oh, a puppy thank home. Oh, okay. thank, you. Thank, you. Thank, you. thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We love Can them. I post this on YouTube, guys? Of course. All right. <laughs> yeah. That's great. She came We're walking happy. through her heart. Where are you going? <laughs> so I think that one will last him for a while. Yes. Well, this one lasts Rosie for a while. Is it too big still? I think it's still too big. Like I said, mm. I don't think what's coming through it in the front. Yeah. <laughs> they don't adjust that. No, usually one for a cat when they're that young, but they'll grow out of it really quick. This will go smaller, though, won't it? Yeah, only in the oh, back, oh, not no. the front. Yeah. Which, what size is that? He said extra small. Says X, X small. Again, Carol and I would like to thank everyone who took a puppy home today and we hope you really enjoy your new pet. I guess you could say this is Wesley's or us. That's right, yep. <laughs> Thanks, yep. Carol. Feel better. Yeah. <laughs> oh, look, she's trying to rescue him. It's fun to watch these two play one last time. That's so cute. I'd like to thank everyone that met me there in Fultonville. It was a truly enjoyable experience. Oh. So, again, we'd like to remind you to like and subscribe to the video and hit that notifications bell up with all that's going on around here on my west east tv i think they're nine weeks, nine weeks. yeah because yeah, we were going to do it last week but carol wasn't feeling well and this this is what seven weeks for him yep one more you want to hold them? Okay. i will later. Don't worry about it. what's your name pal that's maggie that's hi maggie Magnolia. yeah nice she's 14. Maggie in this wow we, re we retire our dogs at at eight. Oh, do you really? I have a little retirement home, so we have a lot of retired Westies that just run out in the one pasture and they just have a great time. Hi, Rosie. Hi. Hey, Rosie. Well, good luck, guys. I'm running out of steam now. Mm -hmm. I can tell. The tail's still going now. Say goodbye, Daddy. Goodbye. What's his name? Finn. Finn. F I N E. And I know I'm going to take a lot of grief, or not grief, but jokes, because I'm a fisherman. I oh. had nothing to do with it. You know? <laughs> okay, Finn. Finn Allen. Finn Allen. Nice. Yeah, well, the last guy was Duncan. He'll keep us on our toes, I'm sure. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So cute. You feel, just put your hand in the middle of the tent. Yeah. Oh, yeah, when you put your hand there, you feel like little piranha, puppy yeah. piranhas. Mm -hmm. Thank everyone yep. for watching My Westies TV. If you haven't, please subscribe. Hit that notifications bell to keep up with us, what, all that's going on here on My Westies TV. Everyone have a great weekend. And we're off. We're going from Fultonville over to the Erie Canal Welcome Center. Have a good day. You too, thank you. So join me as we go up the uh, Interstate 90 in New York State, heading towards Buffalo and 90 West. The throughway. We 
We just did a puppy delivery to Fultonville. And we're headed home. One o'clock in the afternoon. Should be home about four. 30, maybe five o'clock, depending how long we stay at the Valley Welcome Center. Right along the Erie Canal. Fairly new. I've been out here several times and I have never stopped, so today's a beautiful day to stop at the Mohawk Valley Welcome Center. One of the locks on the Erie Canal. If you've never been to the Erie Canal, I would highly recommend a visit. Take a ride on a boat or just walk along, bring your bike, go along the bike trails and spend some time on the Erie Canal. Mohawk Valley, a Valley of Challenge. General George Washington, 1781. Colonel Marinus Willett arrived to lead the Patriot forces across the Mohawk Valley frontier. And Washington tours the valley back in 1783. You can pause the video and read the information at your leisure came to check out the water. Probably supposed to stay on the walking path. On the Erie Canal. Amazing feat of engineer, engineering. I definitely recommend that you uh, check out the history of the Erie Canal. There's a book called The Erie Canal, like Scary Erie Canal. Very good book. I definitely recommend it. But this is the canal that changed America. The Erie Canal was the first major commercially successful connection between the East Coast and the Western Frontier. The Erie Canal soon became an information superhighway, sort of like the internet today. And the canal towpath even served as one of the routes for the Underground Railroad. The canal provided a critical supply line to help North win the Civil War, so definitely recommend checking out the history of the Erie Canal. There are so many stops. We live down by locks 38 and 39. This is lock number 13 in the Mohawk Valley. So the mighty flood sweep down the Mohawk almost every string, spring. So the builders of the original Erie Canal recognized the river's power and laid up, laid out their artificial waterway well above flood levels. Again, you can hear the water over going over the spillway. And you can feel free to pause the video and read this at your leisure. <clears throat> Absolutely beautiful area. Again, the Mohawk Valley is strategically placed in the war in 1775, 1777. Again, feel free to pause the video and read these at your leisure and take a picture, screenshot. Pull down the Erie Canal. What one of the ports would look like, like Lockport, Middleport, Spencerport, would have these keel boats come in that are pulled by donkeys. I definitely recommend the book, The Erie Canal. It's a story about some kids that go back in time on the Erie Canal. I highly recommend it.
again a representation of the keelboat and what the ports would look like with one parked there at their docks there's the welcome center we won't be going inside because i have to get back on the road they've got food and snacks and it's western new york suit or souvenir new york souvenirs it's a lot of farming along the erie canal again because of the commerce Again, feel free to pause the video and read these at your leisure. Again, an important, an important feat of engineering that definitely changed history, the Erie Canal. All right, I hope you enjoy this short video. Take care.
Sweet. And we are home. Road trip is over. Until next time. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Hit that notifications bell. Everyone take care. The end.